What's going on everybody? Ultimate Prepper here with today's episode on EDC, which as we all know means exterminate. Don't cry when shit hits the fan. Let's get into it. You always want to have knives and for everything I talk about today, redundancy is the name of the game. Got an awesome pocket knife here. Opens up, it's sharp, only knife you're ever gonna need. I got a second pocket knife right next to it. In case that one breaks or I lose it. Open it up, super sharp, only knife you're ever gonna need. Well, looky loo, what do I have here? The super trademark back pocket knife. Open it up, super sharp, only knife you're ever gonna need. We got a fixed blade knife, only knife you're ever gonna need. Another one, slightly brighter, only knife you're ever gonna need. Got us a survival knife here. Got us another one, a hatchet, an axe. A katana! And last but not least, the practical tactical. Only knife you're ever gonna need. All right, next, a good handgun. Then a more good handgun. And then a bestest good handgun here. And don't forget the patented tactical bug out boot pistol. Only pistol you're ever gonna need. So there you have it. That's everything I carry on myself to make sure Big Farm can't take nothing from me. And I promise when JFK and Elvis return, this is all you're ever gonna need to demolish those snowflakes and survive the new apocalypse. What knives or guns do you think I need? Missing a caliber? Let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the end. Welcome back. What's going on guys? Joshua here. Thanks for watching Reasonably Prepared. I'm Isaiah. And uh, it's 2022 and you know, I didn't want to make this video, these cover video for a long time, but I've had a couple people ask me, uh, what do we carry around on us every day? And so we thought we would do a 2022 right now, what we do EDC or everyday carry pocket dump. So everything that we carry on us every single day, we're just going to do a full pocket dump for you guys and do head to toe. Well, I guess excluding our regular clothes being fall, I've got my hoodie on. So go check out our merch, reasonpair.com, where you can get a prepared as equal paranoid hoodie, all that fine stuff. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, everything like that. So, yep. what do we carry on us, and how do we want to do this? Uh, let's do pockets and... Okay, pockets. Yeah, so like left pocket. Okay, so this is literally just an indicative of what I like, always have yeah. on me. Always. Me too. All the time. So, front left pocket. Yeah. My phone. I've got some change in... A wipe to clean my glasses. Right there. I wonder how much of this is going to be a pattern because I have some of that kind of stuff. <laughs> so my, my phone, and you'll notice, I live on the edge. What is my phone missing? No case. I've never carried my phone in a case before, ever. People tell me I'm nuts, but they also replace their phones, and this one's three years, three and a half years old now. You've always seen me with no cases on Correct. my phone. So I don't have cases on my phone. All right, right right front pocket. Oh, man. That's my uh, my things. main pocket. Oh, that's your main pocket? Yeah. Mine is my left front pocket. I have two things. I have a Bic lighter, one of the micro Bic lighters in a very loud color, and an equally loud, my pocket knife. Nice. What do you, what, what do you yeah, have? Yeah, I have a lighter as well. Uh, it's orange, uh, my wallet, the keys to my my truck, and uh, my trusty old pocket knife. What kind you got? Spider Co. Which one? This one. <laughs> it's the BCR13MOV. Everyone knows that one. Yeah. And I'm carrying a Benchmade Mini Griptilian. Uh, with the sheep's foot blade, they don't make this one anymore, this lime green. This swing's so old. Um, yeah. How long have you had your... Uh, you know uh, me, I've had this for how long, man? <laughs> right. Uh, probably about the same time. Um, maybe You might have had yours longer, but not much longer than when I got this one. I've had this one maybe eight years. Oh, no. this I've had this one a minimum of 15 years. Oh, okay. So you put your keys in your pocket? I do. I hang my keys from a carabiner. And on my keys, I keep 10 feet of paracord. Actually, I think this is 12 feet. 12 yeah, feet of paracord. And I have a, I really like these. I've been trying to find these again by going into Cabela's. They're, a, they're five bucks. Cabela's flashlight. It's a cool little 
Oh, I just need to see type flashlight. It's probably 50 lumens or something like that. It's probably the same with all my phone, but it's super convenient. They're five bucks. I usually keep them in a dump bin, but for the last couple months, I've been trying to find them. Um, we have a Cabela's by the house and they're like, no, we're out, we're out. And they haven't gotten them in, so I don't know why. So that's my keys that I always have on me. I Back left? Yeah, but I don't have any. Oh, I have some change in my back left. So you keep your phone in my back left pocket. And you, when you sit on it, it doesn't break? No. I got 50 cents in change. 25 cents worth of change. 25 cents worth of change. <laughs> back right. Nothing. You keep nothing. I have my nothing. wallet. Um, and I don't keep anything prepper related in my wallet. I've had this wallet since before my, I think for like 25 years. Wow. Yeah, show them yeah. your wallet. So you... I got this for Christmas. I asked for it uh, and I got it, but it's a slim uh, design wallet. It's RFID blocking and it holds up to like 15, 16 cards. So these aren't all credit cards, you know, driver's license and uh, CHL and uh, all that. So. RFID, radio frequency identification, I think is what it is. Yep. So they can't copy your cards They can't your copy chips. The, the chips and card off. Uh, That's kind of cool. Through my wallet. So, plus it has a little clip where I put my money on there and it it's goes in my front wallet. Super light. Super light. Uh, it's got a carbon fiber design on it. You know, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, you just push them out and you got your cards. So, got that. Um, I, I love it. So super light but you keep your wallet in your front pocket I which do. is probably safer yeah i wear i usually wear a spot in my pants uh, we're forgetting oh uh -huh. glasses by nike for me these are nike glasses uh have really good insurance and so they uh were able to buy me a really nice pair of glasses wow. super bad vision though i can hardly see the camera so so his vision is worse than mine i can see but it it I it still kind of sucks, yeah. and I have old man bifocals for reading. Mm, old man, old man bifocals. Uh, firearm pistol. Yeah, yeah. Um, we're both carrying a similar pistol. I'm gonna unload, make save. Uh, what holster? Uh, this is the badass holster. That's literally what it's called. Oh, that's right. I remember you uh, bought that at that one gun show. Right. And so uh, we see th this company, uh, the representative for this company, always at gun shows. And uh, this is a multi-purpose holster. Uh, it can hold guns, axes, anything you want to put in there. If you want to hold something on your side, it'll fit in there. So Yeah. And I have Bravo Concealment. Thank you, Bravo Concealment. They sent us this holster. I'm going to be doing a review on it. I want to thank them for sending this to us. Not a sponsor yet, um, but we just thank them for sending it. Definitely. Uh, and I'm going to do a full review on it. And I'm in conversation with them about trying to become uh, a sponsor, but they did send me this. I'm excited about this review here um, because it is very lightweight. Yeah, they did send me, they uh, did allow us to do... Um, I have an affiliate link, so if you check the affiliate link below, you get 10% off. I get a commission on it. Um, so for their holsters, and this is for the Hellcat. Yep. And he's carrying a Hellcat as well. Um, and it fits really nice, and with the optics even. Mine is the optics ready. Actually, not optics ready. It has the, it has optics. the optics on it, yeah. And um, typically, I have a second magazine on me as well. Um, if I'm going out and about, I'll carry a second one. And all of these things, I carry redundancies in my truck as well. Right. That's where I usually carry my extra magazines is in my truck. Yeah, I have an extra magazine I carry on me. This came with a 11 round and a 13 round, and I bought a 15 round. 15 rounds in my truck, 13 round is in the pistol, and my uh, the 11 round I usually keep inside back here. Yeah. Um, also Bravo concealment. All right. Hey, send us some pictures of your EDC. What yeah. are you guys carrying around? What knives you got? You know, what, what are tools that you can't live without that are on your person every day? I got friends that carry multi-tools literally every day. What are you know, the, the Leatherman? Leathermans yeah. and things like that. What are you guys carrying around? Leave them in the comments below. Hey, if uh, we get enough, maybe we could do a montage of them. Ooh, send us the pictures. We'll do yeah. a we'll do a we'll do a subscriber montage. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah. All right, guys. Thanks That's for it. watching. Yep. And remember, just because you're prepared doesn't mean you're paranoid. See you next time.